Are they leaving? Oh, no. All right, I think they're leaving. I got to take that shot. Hello, everyone, and welcome back to Call of the Wild. Today, we're back on Rancho for an extra special challenge. You see, the last time I was here, I tried out the Grelic Drilling Rifle Select, and things didn't really go so well. However, today's video is about redemption. So not only will I be attempting to hunt every single species on this map in under 60 minutes, I'll also only be using this beast of a gun. Oh, and don't forget to stick around to the end of the video to hear who had the most liked dad joke and won themselves one of my free hats. All right, time is set to eight o'clock, so we're ready to go. And three, two, one, and go. All right, time to get hunting. So I think we should be able to find pheasant pretty easy in this area. But if not, that's going to be... Whoa. Oh, I heard something. <gasps> Mating call, Bobcat. Now, that should be close enough. It might be able to hear our caller. All right, I'm getting impatient. I'm going to keep moving. Probably not a good idea, especially after calling it in. But I guess we'll just walk in this area. Where are we going? It's a little bit... Oh, yeah, it's not quite where I want to go. I'm just hoping she's like a level one female. It should be real easy to trick. Oh, shit. All right, you know what? We know he's there. We know he's pissed off. I'm going to let him calm down a little bit, and we're going to slowly sneak up on him. But he must be super close. Oh, that's him right there. All right, here we go. I think we got him. Well, we definitely did there. There we go. Oh, I hope it was the right... Was it the right ammo? Oh, no. All right, there he is right there. I think we're going to have to go with... Uh, with not worrying about getting vital hits with this gun, because the buckshot and birdshot, there's no penetration whatsoever. And we get ourselves a nice oh, silver because we couldn't get a great shot on it. Yeah, that buckshot does not penetrate, so we're not going to worry about that. We just need to kill them. But we got him. First one of the day. There we go, Pablo. I'm going to switch it over, though, because I heard some birds. Let's get this set up. Oh, look at this little watering hole here. This is kind of nice. But I have a feeling we spooked everything around here. Oh, turkey. Ooh, okay. We're going back where we just came from. Because there should be some turkeys. Did I just see something? Ooh, whitetail. Oh my god, this area is packed. There we go. All right. How do we take him out, though? He's a class four, right? Oh, no. Are they coming in to drink? Oh, they are. All right, this is pretty much my only chance to take these guys out because they're class four and... Oh, you know what? We can do it with our slugs. All right, it's going to be hard, but I'm going to see if I can take him down with some slugs. Now, the recommended distance on the slug is 54 yards. That is trash. So let's just move over here a little bit more and see if we can get them to go in by the water. All right, they're moving. Oh, look at him. What a, I love them. They're so beautiful. Unfortunately, I got to try to take out these deer first because I think it's going to be harder to come across. But if we're lucky... Oh my... <laughs> that poor deer. If we're lucky, we might be able to take them both out. You know, I'm not loving this position here, but I think we just need to... Just need to do it. Oh. <laughs> okay, goodbye. Oh, yep. Look at him. Oh, I don't want to risk it. But such a cool looking bird, though. Oh, it's going to be such a difficult shot. Did we hit him? We did. And I hit him again. All right. He should die from that. And can I switch it over? Quick. There we go. Come on. Oh, there's no more ring neck. Crap. All right, that's okay, though. We got it. I think we got him down. I think we hit him in the vital. Yes, we did. All right, awesome. Oh, yep, he died right there. That's so good. Did we... I think those are two vitals on top of each other. Nice. All right, big guy. How good were you? We got... He's a silver. We got to be quick about this. We got him in the lung. And that's it. Oh, we only hit him once. Sucks he's only a silver, but there we go. All right, Pablo, where do we go now? All right, so I'm going to run around. If I hear a warning call, then I'll go towards. I think that's our best play here. Oh, what's that? 
shit, it's another white tail. I at least want to spot it. Oh, Pablo, you little shithead. Get out of there. Oh, no, it's gone now because of you, Pablo. What the fuck, man? Ooh. Oh, no, pronghorn. All right. Um, they're traveling, but that's a good sign. Ooh, what was that? I think that was a bobcat. Man, this area's loaded. Oh, look at that. A bunch of pronghorn. Oh, four. Ooh. All right, that's a guy I want to take out. Calm, eating. Let's double check. How long will they be eating there for? Until nine o'clock. Oh, no, they're going to be leaving now. Shit. And there's no way to call him in. But man, he's a good looking four. He's a really good looking four. Mating call, ringneck pheasant. Ooh, do I go for it? It might be better just go for them. Okay, the pheasant should be somewhere in here. But I'm not seeing them. But it is going to give us a really good vantage point on those pronghorn, though. So it's not a bad thing that we came up in here. That's weird. All right, I have no idea where those guys went. We'll find more later. But for right now, we need to get back on those pronghorn. There they are. Oh, what was that? Oh, you son of a bitch. There we go. Okay, first of all, did we spook our pronghorn? Alarmed, traveling. That's okay. That's damn, he's good. But there's two level fours in there. I'll take either one, but I'd rather take that good one. All right, let's go. <laughs> let's slowly go up to this guy. I thought we lost this thing for sure. All right, here we go. What were you, buddy? Man, you're such a good looking bird. It was a silver. Crap. But we did kill it. That's fine. That's two species today. No, that's three. We already got three already. Damn, we're doing pretty good. A quarter of the way into the challenge. Not bad. Wait, alert. Attentive. Oh, it's because these guys are a bit spooked. Um, I don't know how he noticed me some, from so far away. He must be pretty good, actually. Yeah, this guy didn't notice me, but that one way, way, way back in there did. So I'm thinking he might be diamond potential. At least he's a really good gold. Oh, no. Oh, no, we made him run. But if everyone else is also running too, I'm going to try to take that guy out. Oh, come on, switch over. Um, let's see if I can do it. Oh, no, it's going to take too long. I don't think we can make it work, but I'm going to try. Maybe just take out a level one female or something. Don't want to mess anyone too good up. Oh, no, we missed completely. Shit. Did we just chase him down? I think we might try to chase him down. Probably not a good idea to focus on these guys, but I got a little bit of a lead right now, and I'm letting it get to me. Oh, wait, hold up. Blood trail, very low. <gasps> we did hit one with that. No way. All right, as long as it kills him, it's fine. I'm just hoping it wasn't the really good one. Plus, that'll let us see how good that 112 was. Was he 112 or 103? All right, I think we need to slow down now. We ran after him for a while. She's bleeding out super, super slowly. Oh my God, she did actually die. All right, that'll be a pronghorn. It's not how I wanted to take her out, but that'll work. What's that? Oh, it's coyote. All right, if I switch over to jackrabbit collar, come on, please work. You know what guys? I'm not seeing anything coming in. I don't think we're gonna end up getting that coyote. All right, I guess we gotta keep moving. Oh, what was that? No, Mexican bobcat. So we did call in one, but, uh, <laughs> oh, warning call turkey. You know what? That means we got to run at him. Let's go, Pablo. Get ourselves some turkey. Oh, come on. Where are you? I see it. Oh, is it dead? I'm not sure, but it is now. There we go. Easy. Super easy. All right, he oh, we did hit it twice. It was just dying slowly. It was a gold four. Wow, it was almost a diamond. Holy crap. Nice. All right, most of them are gold anyways, but still, that was a really good gold. There we go. Right, let's switch that over. I don't think we need any more level one. Oh, we do. We need to get antelope uh, jackrabbit. Damn. All right, let's go. Maybe this way is a good way to go now. Oh, there she is right there. All right, I'm going to tell him to stop tracking because he's going to make so much noise. 
Thankfully, he doesn't spook animals in this game. Otherwise, I'd never see anything. Now it's time to check if that other guy was a diamond potential. Diamond for them is 98. Holy shit. I think he was a diamond. Do we go after him and risk it? Oh, this is this is rough. You know what? I think we got to try Pablo. It would be wrong not to. Coyote fleeing. No, that's oh, damn. That's rough. All right, Pablo. We know that there's a bunch of crap in here. We've got colored peccary. We've got coyote. We need to be really careful. But there's no warning call, though. We might need to get to an open area and just start calling stuff. And hopefully, hopefully something will come in. All right, this is a pretty good vantage point right here. We should be able to get a bit of a lay of the land. And maybe we spot our next victim. Victim sounds weird. Maybe I shouldn't call them victims. All right, that's a place right there. If we don't see anything here in the next little bit, we... Oh, warning call. There we go. All right, we just chill out. And we let it come to us. Okay, he should be somewhere up in here. Somewhere in here is where I heard him. And I didn't hear a fleeing noise. So he could still be around. If he runs though, they are wait. Alert, traveling. All right, here we go. Wait. Okay, yeah, that'll take him out. Oh, wait, did we hit him? I'm gonna hit him again. Please go down. <laughs> I don't know if he's gonna die from that. I think it was a decent hit though. I wasn't sure as soon as I saw him being class four Was he class four? No, he wasn't. All right, good. I, I read the wrong thing. I got confused All right, he died right there. So I messed up a little bit I saw that he was level four and my brain freaked out and I'm like, oh my god He's a class four. Do I have the right ammo for this? Thankfully, I didn't change anything because that would have been real dumb That's why you don't panic in situations like this. But oh my god, look at him and we actually did get him in a vital that's pretty good. All right. Oh. Oh, God. Look at his eyes. What the fuck? It looks like some bad taxidermy. Oh, my God. All right. There we go, Pablo. One more animal down. And we are... Oh, God. We only have 28 minutes left in the challenge. This is not good. Oh, there's pronghorn mating call. If it's at level four, you know I'm going to try to take him out, though. I don't care if I lose the challenge. I want myself a diamond pronghorn. All right, buddy. Where are you? Um, ooh. <gasps> there we go. That's what we need right there. Ooh, hold up. Hold up. Let me spot these guys. Yeah, that level four is nothing like that other level four we found. Ooh. Calm eating. Let's get a little bit closer to them. I think we found the peccaries we want to take out. <gasps> Wait a sec. You know what I just realized? We can probably call these uh, peccary in. Yeah, they're not too far out. All right, I'm going to see if I can call him in. This is a perfect spot. Wild boar caller. All right, Pablo, you're going to need to lay down, buddy. You are already making me nervous. Don't sit. Okay, Pablo's right in front of me. I got to move down more now. God damn it, Pablo. Oh, where are the peccary? Ooh, here they come. All right, and I'm also going to lay down. Because we have some really good visibility. We can make them walk pretty much right up on top of us. All right, they're coming a little bit closer. Oh, man. Time is ticking down. They are so slow. Are they leaving? Oh, no. All right, I think they're leaving. I got to take that shot. Oh, I oh, what the hell? I don't think we got him very good. Time to go run at him. Or do I try to take another shot? Oh, I don't. Oh, it died. There we go. We did get it. Whew. Pablo, you were you were a fucking nuisance. I'm sorry, buddy, but my God, you get in the way. All right. Is anything else running? Nothing we need, I don't think. Ow, ow. Oh, my God. Cactus right in the eye. Holy shit. All right, buddy. I got to grab you and get moving. I think we need to fast travel to a different place now. I think we need to go up north. I have a lake in mind though. Oh, silver, and we did get it with a good shot with a liver. Nice. All right, and diamond for them is 144. None of those guys were anywhere near it. There we go. All right, we got more turkeys. I'm not worried about that. The area we want to go to. Oh, do I risk it and go up to that lake? It's closer, and I've never been there. 
There could be Bighorn there. Do I do it? Ugh, fuck it, I do it. All right, let's head over in that area. Hopefully we see something. I got flies in the game flying around my ears and it's pissing me off. And I've got flies in real life flying around my ears and they're really pissing me off. I can't escape them no matter what I do. But I'm just hoping to see an antelope jackrabbit because I think, honestly, I think that's going to be the hardest to find. I think those jackrabbit are going to be buried somewhere. But the mule deer, I can take him out with my rifle. The, the rifle barrel, I can snipe him with that. So that shouldn't be too hard to get. It's just the bighorn I still need to get with the slug. So I got to get real close. Okay, there's a need zone for something. Oh my god, the fucking flies just had to land on my arm. God, talk about immersion though. I feel like I'm actually here. I think I made the wrong decision to come to this lake. I think that was a very, very bad call on my part. All right, the direction we need to go in is this way. All right, I'm going to go this way because I haven't quite taken this path before, so we could come across mule deer because I don't think they're going to be drinking for a while, right? What are, when do muleys drink? Mule deer are 1,400. Yeah, there's a long time, so we just need to come across them. So we need to go somewhere we haven't really been before. Well, we got a whole bunch of need zones here. Oh, oh no. Well, there were some here and they are gone. I'm just going to run up. Maybe we find a few. Maybe we don't. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Oh, we hit him. I'm hoping we hit him twice. There we go. All right. Maybe I can take out another one. Oh, oh my God. We dropped it with one hit. All right. This gun is pretty damn good. Pretty damn good. All right. What a shot. And it was a two female, but man, we dropped her. That did some big damage. All right, only two left to go. And to be honest with you, I have no idea where to go for them. Let me take a look around here. I got to be quick. Um, Oh, antelope jackrabbit on the mountainside here. Mule deer also on the mountainside here. Mule deer. Okay, you know what? We got to go back here. Maybe, just maybe we can do this. But we got to go run up that mountain as quick as possible. Oh, come on, game. Hurry up, hurry up. All right, we have no other choice but to run. We just have to full sprint. We got to scare something and shoot it while it's going. Five minutes left. Oh, this is not looking good. We just got a full sprint. If we come across something. Oh, very old mule deer. All right. At least we found a track of them. At least that's something. But where are they? Oh, here we go. Mule deer. Uh, where is it? Oh, no, I don't see it. Oh, wow. He's good. He's real good. But he's also really far out. As soon as he walks in, I'll try to drop him. Fuck. Did I hit him? I did. Oh, no. I don't know. It might not have been very good. Wait, there's Whitetail here too? Oh, my God. All right, we got to switch this over. Hold on. Got to switch this over here. All right. Is there any Jackrabbit? Well, that Mule Deer died, so that's a good sign. Now, there should be some jackrabbit down here. We just got to find him. I don't know, guys. I'm not seeing much. Oh, that was a vital. Nice. Let's grab him really quick. And he was a gold, 244. Pretty good. All right. Where the hell are the jackrabbit? We got less than two minutes. Oh, no. 40 seconds left. Oh, shit. It's not looking good, Pablo. 20. Oh, no. If there's going to be... Maybe they're by the road. I've seen them in open fields by the road before. So maybe, just maybe. Oh, less than 10 seconds. I don't think it's going to happen. Wait. Did I see something? Oh, no. Two, one, and that's it. We are done. We failed the challenge. Oh, we were so close. One more animal. Let me double check. I think it was only one more animal. That's a dinky little uh, mule deer, level two. I think that's the smallest mule deer I've ever seen. Let me just, uh, let me just take that guy out really quick. There we go. Oh, eight mythical. Okay. Wow. All right. So I want to grab this mule there. He might go on the wall of shame and damn, that was a really good bobcat. So we have white tail deer, turkey, pheasant, mule deer, bobcat, coyote, peccary, sheep. And the only one we missed was the antelope jackrabbit. Oh, and we have pronghorn too. So yeah, the only one we missed was uh, 
Antelope Jackrabbit. You know, maybe if we came over to this area first, we would have got him. But what can you do? Oh my god, he died right out in front of the cabin. If we would have fast traveled here, we would have been right on top of him. That is so cool. All right. He would have been... Oh, he would have been a bronze. You know what that means, right, guys? That's a wall of shame. That is a wall of shame material. So we're going to taxidermy him. There we go. Oh my god, that was expensive. 8,000 because we messed him up. And... I'm going to go after that pronghorn, but I am going to switch my loadout because there's no way I'm going to risk messing up that pronghorn. All right, so I spawn back in at this first place here, the first outpost. We're going to go up to where we got that ringneck pheasant. I'm hoping we get a really good view on those pronghorn. All right, I'm going to try to take him out. He's on a little bit of a weird angle, kind of a weird incline, but... Oh, it's a mating call. All right, I think I'm going to try to take him. I'm going to use my 243. That way, it doesn't instantly kill him. So if I do mess him up here, I do have another chance. We hit him. And... Did I hit him again? Oh, I don't think so. Let's spot. See if we see anything good. Oh, please tell me I didn't mess him up. I don't know where he is. No idea where he is. But he's dead. So I'm hoping that was okay. Oh, no. Well, I'm not seeing a... Oh, hold on a second. Yup, that is a vital. Nice. All right. Now it's just on him. Hopefully, he's a diamond. All right, here we go. And... Oh, okay, we only hit him once. And we got him with a really good shot. Diamond is 98. He's a 92. Damn. Damn. I, I was sure that this guy went up to like 112 for some reason. I don't know why. But... Either way, we got ourselves a beautiful, probably my biggest pronghorn I've ever gotten. All right, there we go. Time to go to our trophy lodge and set up that dinky little mule deer. That crocodile, though. Oh, my God. Damn. That's a, that's a nice throat. I never really noticed that. <clears throat> Anyways, um, yeah, where are we going to put this guy? All right, here we go. I'm going to put my mule deer on that one. And <laughs> you cannot go there. You are way too bad to go there. And I'm going to place you up there. Boom. There we go. All right. The Hall of Shame is looking pretty damn good. Still, this is the best one of my Hall of Shame, though. Look at the size of that pronghorn. So, the moment you've all been waiting for. Who won the dad joke competition? The winner is Shiny Rex 286 What do you call an alligator who is always wearing a vest? An investigator and you know what that is that is a dad joke for sure so <laughs> good job there so yeah congratulations you've won yourself a free hat and send me a message on discord or email me with proof that it's actually you and we'll get everything sorted out also i'm gonna be live streaming bigfoot with some friends on sunday so don't forget to stop by guys it is gonna be a blast so i'd like to give a big thank you to all my channel members you guys are the best and if you guys enjoyed today's video, don't forget to drop a like. And if you want to see more videos like this one in the future, don't forget to subscribe. Thanks, guys. My name is Rooster, and I'll see you in the next one.